Since we're gonna do a duck gumbo, I'm gonna start with some duck. And if you just sort of make a little score like this. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start searing this. And we gotta season it. Kick this duck up a few notches. We're gonna start in this right here with a little bit of oil and some flour. And you gotta do a little roux of love is what I call it. Onion, celery, <laughs> bell pepper. <laughs> gonna kick it up with some cayenne. Once that cooks for about six or eight minutes, you gotta keep stirring it. We're gonna add some bay leaves. I thought I'd add some andouille sausage in there too. I think I'll use some wild mushrooms in there. I'm gonna use a little bit of stock. Now we're gonna let this come to a boil and you can see that I'm slowly stirring it again. You wanna add a little bit of green onions in there for garnish. We're gonna use a little parsley. I'm gonna add the sassafras in there to kick it up a couple of notches. You want crawfish tails in your gumbo? Great. If you want shrimp, hey, fine. You wanna put chicken, whatever you like. Just make sure it's seasoned. If you are using, if you are using crawfish tails, make sure they're from the Louisiana. We don't want any of those impostas. So we dice this up. You don't have duck, you can use chicken. You don't have crawfish, use shrimp, use fish. But look at that, you see how we got that nice gumbo right there? A big bowl of gumbo, make you happy, happy, happy. Serve it just like that and serve it with a nice little bit of rice like that. And that's it, if you wanna garnish it, you just garnish it with little green onions. Bam!